In Brevard County, new details are emerging about a disturbing discovery over the weekend in the parking lot of this Melbourne apartment complex. Police now say a St. Lucie woman and her three-year-old twins are at the center of a death investigation. Channel 9's Melanie Holt is live at the Manatee Cove Apartments in Melbourne. And Mel, this is such a sad situation. Have police told you anything about what happened to them? They told me they are still actively investigating this case. We do know that investigators don't think the victims lived at this apartment complex, but this is where a mother and her two children, a three-year-old boy and a three-year-old girl, were found inside of their car. I wish I knew what happened. Melbourne police believe 35-year-old Andrea Langhorse and her three-year-old twins Olivia and Adam Dreyer were likely parked at the Manatee Cove Apartments on Madeline Way for days before their car drew attention and a call was made to 911. The windows are all fogged. That they said there's like a really bad stench coming out of it, but you can't see into the car because the windows are so fogged. When police arrived, they discovered the bodies of Langhorse and her children. Investigators believe they may have been living out of their vehicle along the east coast of Florida. That's two babies. Um, I'm a dad myself. I have three kids. One of my kids is two. Um, he'll be three next month, and that just, honestly, that breaks my heart that it was two children. Detectives are now working closely with the Brevard County Medical Examiner's Office to learn more about the family's deaths. But detectives don't believe there's any danger to the community. I imagine that, you know, the kids couldn't really do anything if something happened to the mom first. So that changes a lot. It really makes you wonder what happened that led up to that. I was able to reach Andrea Langhorst's father. He doesn't believe she was living out of her vehicle. In fact, he told me she has friends all over Melbourne. He also said that she and the twins spent the entire month of December with him. He added that what his family needs most right now are prayers. Live here in Melbourne, Melanie Holt, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.